Okay, I'm bringing Sexy back. Sexy is in my 175 floor machine. <laughs> uh, you that follow my channel know that uh, I tried to weld that bracket where I modified and put the bigger wheels. And my welding skills were not that great. And we come to find out that the uh, area that we were welding is some kind of composite, uh, like almost concrete. So it didn't uh, hold up to the welding. It fell apart. The wheels just dropped right off the unit. And today, when I was using the Koblenz, I was in a home that had some faulty wiring and it blew the capacitor. It's under warranty, so I'll get that fixed shortly. But in the meantime, I needed a backup machine other than my mighty um, Eco 14. So I want to put this back to use. You can see I used that uh, JB Weld Epoxy 6-Minute Quick Set. It's not a pretty sight, but it worked fantastic. And being that it's a 6-Minute Set, it seeped into all the grooves and then hardened pretty quick. So unlike the other regular JB Weld that last time I used it on another repair, it kind of dripped through. This did the trick. You can see there, there's the JB Weld. And like I said, I'll probably paint that black under there. I don't think anyone's going to be tipping my machine over and looking underneath it, but it should hold up fine. I'm going to put this one back into the system tomorrow. So look for my video uh, tomorrow that I post during my lunch break. I'll try and post one of them. And this one does have that shower feed tank capabilities. So I'm looking forward to getting back into the shower feed mode on the jobs that I can use it uh, that way. So there you go. I thought I'd just share this and update with you what's going on with the Koblenz. So I appreciate you watching. Stay posted and we'll see how the 175 gets the job done tomorrow.